Everybody, Saturday afternoon here at Classic Car Creations. I'm Earl. Kevin and Hank are working on the floor for the 53 Ford. We just moved this out of the paint booth today, and uh, they're going to be putting the template in. That's what it is out there. We're calling it that. And uh, they're taking the bracing off because we're going to use the 53 bracing onto that floor pan. And then we're going to make it, mod it, so we can put the battery tray and sink the battery tray down in it and get ready for a fuel access door because we have a fuel cell there. So that's what's going on with that car. Dan French is 57 Chevy, came back for work. And the paintwork that you already see on that particular car is stuff we did last year. Um, we're gonna be completing that car along with Project LS in rotation with Hank's truck. So we're gonna be hot on the trail on doing these vehicles as well as getting in one more project this year and that should be Eleanor that's up in Pensacola right now and Glenn is currently doing door hinges on his and he's trying to get the overall gap. Once he succeeds on that I think he's going to be pretty close and we're ready for him because we're in rotation here and we have one bay open for him um, because we changed around the paint job on the GTO until next year so the restoration on that one will be finished next year and Doyce's cab is out of here, it's over in the high bay. The chassis is coming in for that next week. I couldn't believe how fast that showed up. That is fast compared to what we had with Hanks. It took us a month and a half. And the shipping company actually lost the frame. Go figure. Anyway, it didn't happen this time. They really expedited it, so it jams us a little bit. So we're on double time here. this one too.
Now I can go bye byes. Alright, let's plug that shoe while I'm in here. Okay. Get that, and then this thing will be just about all I got to do. That's the forward half of the. That's the forward half of the driver's side rear fender repair, and that's what's left of the old one, the old piece you took out. Okay. Mm -hmm. And there's a fair bit of yeah. cheese in her. Yeah. Patch that Hank made here for this side. Yeah, we got a patch yeah. made for that one. That I don't even need anymore. Okay. That one's looking really kick ass now. Alright, let's get on to the next side. Let's try and get the metal work done today on these fenders so I can get on to smoothing them out tomorrow. I got all the dents out of this one. Got a high, knock that down. I got to put a profile in right here. It does this, it arcs. I get that flat and I'm good. The two slices are out, that one's gone. And I got an imprint right in here. And that one's gonna bust my balls. The air ducts. They're ready for zinc chrome and 2K. We're ready to get out from under those. Metal work is all done in them, up in the headlight corners. Without these, you can't mount the headlights in on a 57. And we're gonna take care of this issue here. We're gonna dolly hammer flat, weld it up. That's the inside patch on that. We're gonna clean that up. This side, what I do, after we take it down initially, we clean the area, and then it goes nice and flat. There will be nothing in there.
got that flat, it was all fucked up. Yeah, see, it's, now it's the same as that one. So everyone, that's the updates going on here at the shop for Saturday and Sunday. Kind of merged the two days together on this vlog to show you what's going on. Mostly we've been working on Doyce's, Hank's floor, stuff like that. We're trying to get the 253s processed as fast as we can with all the metal work, get that behind us, and then start putting panels on vehicles and everything. Finally do a breakdown on Hank's truck to go to paint. That's a big deal here. And Doyce's frame is coming real fast. I think it's going to be delivered this week, so we got to get that in the high bay here and get this thing out of here for a little bit. It's got to stop for a little bit. We got to get a chassis together. So, lot and shuffle. We'll keep everybody in tune with what's going on at the shop here. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you, everyone, for checking us out. It's greatly appreciated. Take care, everyone.